Like others, the oil market spent the previous trading day standing still. This is largely due to the stagnation in the currency market, which is likely to continue today. Speaking of the short-term outlook, the main factor contributing to the recent decline in the oil prices was the release of the worse-than-expected economic data from China. Thus, the most likely scenario suggests a gradual decline in the near future. Brent crude oil futures are trading under pressure, which signals ongoing weakness. The volume of short positions will increase further if the price fixes below $78 and $20. In the long term, this may pave the way for a deeper decline to the level of $77. As for gold, the situation is similar. The only difference is that the precious metal is being wind down by major central banks' continued tightening of a monetary policy. Moreover, its impact is poorly negative. Thus, gold will inevitably drop at least to the level of $1,900 per three ounces. Further market dynamics will depend on the Federal Reserve and the European Central Bank. If, if they keep raising interest rates, gold will most likely fall below uh, $1,900 per three ounces. In the meantime, gold futures are moving near the high of the upward cycle, with no dramatic changes from the technical point of view. The asset will gain value if the price consolidates above the $1,965 mark. Until then, the metal is expected to trade sideways. The ruble remains range-bound. However, stagnation in the global currency market has nothing to do with it. This can rather be attributed to the Bank of Russia's report on the balance of payments to be published soon. If Russia's current account plus shrinks or uh, turns negative, the US dollar will instantly jump to 95 rubles and probably 100 rubles per dollar. If the current account plus widens slightly, the greenback will dip at least to 80 rubles, partly due to the oversold status of the Russian currency. And that's all for now. We wish you profitable deals. See you know channel with a new video in a couple of hours.